Hello everybody, this is Boaz Fale and I'm here with the Daily Astrology Forecast for September 30th, 2016. This is a day of a new moon in Libra. As I say always, when it's a new moon, we are imprinted with the energies for the next lunar cycle of 29 and a half days. So keep yourself as positive, as, as pure as possible today. Do not feed negativity. The new moon in Libra can talk about a few things. First of all, relationships and love, as this is Venus, Libra, and that could mean a new cycle in terms of us searching for something we are lacking in general. Not only relationships, not only love, but bringing balance, bringing equilibrium back into our life in a sense. And that means that Venus also rules everything that is of value, every materialistic a monetary field as well everything that can provide us with satisfaction and when we are searching for that and looking for new ways and new interactions to bring that blissful plenty into our lives to to bring that satisfaction into our life to bring that balance and equilibrium back into our life we could uh, experience new beginnings we can experience new journeys new voyages as this new moon begins today. The moon is still void, of course, if you are in Europe up until 9 a.m., then it moves into Libra, squaring Mars. Now, this is a sensitive time, especially in relationships. So, from 9 a.m. for the next four hours, sensitive time in relationships. And then, at around uh, 1300 hours, I'm sorry, at around 1300 hours, Central European time, that's around 7 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Uh, it's already calming down and around 1700 hours Central European time, that's 12 noon time Eastern Standard Time, the sky looks already a lot better with a conjunction to Jupiter. It's a time full of intuition. It's a time of much more romance in the air. We could be very, uh, very emotional, even too emotional. And you know, and that romance is it can be heightened as well by the fact that Venus in the sky is trining Neptune. Venus, the planet of love and relationships, trining Neptune. And that could mean that we can be much more sensitive within, within relationships in a good way. We could be much more empathic and romance can return in to our, uh, into our houses, so to speak. Intuition can return into our houses, imagination and talent and anything connected with the arts or with the metaphysical can come back into our relationships and isn't that wonderful so i hope you're going to have a wonderful weekend and i want to thank you for listening this is boaz feiler goodbye